happening guys welcome back to another quick tip tuesday if you're new to the channel my name is jade lofsky and uh you landed on quick tip tuesday here because you might be having a problem with your audio in davinci resolve 17. so one of the things that i noticed is that uh, i might open up a project i already had or sometimes starting a new project drop in my clip and there's no audio i can't hear anything i know the audio is there i can see the waveforms but i can't hear any audio so let's jump into resolve and i'm going to show you how to fix that real quick and easy all right, so here we are in DaVinci Resolve. I just have a random clip in here, and if I play through the clip, we see that there's no audio coming through. So a couple things to check. The first thing, come right over here, make sure that this little uh, mute button here is checked off. You don't want it to be red because then you're not gonna hear anything. Make sure your volume slider is up. And then this dim button right here, that'll reduce the volume a little bit. So if it just sounds quiet and won't get any louder, Go ahead and click on that. Oh, and of course, be sure to make sure your computer volume is up too. And uh, that's gonna make sure that you're gonna be hearing anything that's coming from Resolve. So what you need to do, the actual problem is over here in the Fairlight tab. So you wanna go ahead and open up your mixer. So come on up to the top here, open your mixer. And you wanna come down here and just above your faders, you have bus outputs. So real quick, in DaVinci Resolve 17, they kind of changed how the uh, outputs were the main outs. It used to be called main out, but now it's called buses, and they just have a bus that's the main out. So for some reason, and I don't know why, and I haven't really found any pattern to it, sometimes your audio tracks are not assigned to that main bus so that the audio is getting sent out of DaVinci Resolve. Let's jump back here, show you how to turn it on real quick. So jumping back in here, you want to make sure you see your bus outputs here, and if you don't, Click on these little three icons and make sure you have bus outputs checked on. So then all you have to do is come to the little plus, hit that, and then here I only have one bus, so I'm going to go ahead and select that. And now we see the bus here, and if I play through my clip, we should be hearing some audio. YouTube channel, and I've got a tool I want to share with you guys that I've been using for quite a while. So there we go. Now the audio is coming out, and it's getting sent to our main bus out. So I also wanted to mention one more reason why you might not be getting any sound, and that is if you created an audio preset, like a track preset, which I'm going to show you that I have here. I created a track preset, and when I apply it to my audio track here, my bus changes because it was set in an earlier version of DaVinci Resolve. That's where I saved the preset. But when I apply it here, the bus one didn't exist within that preset, so it actually removes it. So let me show you that real quick. So if I come on up to the Fairlight menu and I come on down to Preset Library... And for me, I have global track presets because I use the same couple mics. And I have this, the Yeti Basement Shop. And I'm going to go ahead and apply that. Now, when I apply that, when I close the window, if we take a look back over here, notice now bus sends, we have nothing. It's not getting sent anywhere. And down here in the bus outputs, it's not getting sent anywhere either. If it was going to the side chain, that would be turned on, but it's not currently. And we're not getting sent to the bus out. So if I play through the video here, we don't hear anything. So in order to fix that, again, we want to come and click on the plus and come down to bus one right here. Now we'll be hearing everything right through uh, our outputs here in DaVinci Resolve. Talking about growing your YouTube. So there you go. Make sure that if you have any presets saved and you apply them, especially a global preset, that your bus outputs are actually getting sent to bus number one. So keep that in mind as you start working in DaVinci Resolve 17 here. The main out is what it used to be called in 16 and previous versions, but now it's called bus one and you can change the name of it here i'm sure if you want by double clicking on it but you need to have your channels getting sent to that bus one so you get your audio out of davinci resolve so if this video was helpful if it was give it a thumbs up subscribe to the channel hit the little bell maybe check out a video up over here or one down over there or another one if i throw another one up on the screen here so thank you guys for watching i will see you in the next video peace